just some thermal fun. Uh, this transformer powers only the Tesla supercharger. There's my car supercharging now. And um, there's three stalls. So that is 360 kilowatts um, worth of charging for cars. This is a 500 kVA transformer. And uh, I'm only drawing about 40 kilowatt right now. You've seen how it's heating up a little bit. Uh, those are the cooling fins. This thing is humming away. Cool on this side, that's where connections are. And there's a nice little breeze coming from the correct side for the cooling fins. Set, recalibrate. It's a pretty nice day, 76 degrees. And for change, the heat's not coming from the car supercharging. That heats my tires. And that's a person. Headlights are a little warm. Tires are hot. Cooling fans aren't going. But like I said, we're not supercharging at too high of a rate. Let's see, what are we supercharging at? Still at 40 kilowatt. 73% battery. <laughs> and that is the station that I am using. Another little neat spot. Go, go in the trunk. There's the access panel there. And that, these are the two conductors going to the battery pack. That's uh, This is behind the charging port here. It's a little hot towards that side. But, uh, like I said, uh, recalibrate. Like I said, we're only at, uh, you know, we're down to 38 kilowatt. I had a half pack when I showed up. Now those do get really, really hot when supercharging at full speed. One thing I noticed, because mine is an older production car, these are single conductors. Uh, the new ones are dual conductor. Uh, so four uh, four conductors instead of two. Each of the each of them though is a lighter gauge, and they're actually cooling down just a wee bit. And there's two women talking again. Say hi. The one on the right's nuts, the one on the left is fairly likable. Hold on. Let's just see what the uh, transformer's back up to. A little higher. Ooh, much hotter. It's building up. <laughs> 